The man we talked about, the frisky Rick DiPietro coming off a 5-0 shutout over the Washington Capitals. 28 wins on the season. That win broke a six-game losing streak. And his quote after the game, it's going to be tough. They've been playing us hard. We need as many fans at the Garden as we can so we can kick the Rangers' butt. But he didn't use butt. He used another word that I goes think, along I with I think butt. you want to dress tonight and play against him. That's <laughs> what I sense. Oh, no. He's my golfing buddy. <laughs> Kevin Weeks, his fifth consecutive start. He has been playing very well. Coaches were saying this morning, John, he's been very effective in his work down low around the net. Sam, all season long, Tom Rennie said, we need two goalies, we need two goalies, we need two goalies. Well, he's right. You need two goalies. That's Chris Rooney. He's joined by, no, that's Paul Dvorsky with Chris slowed down. Bergenheim tried to get around Oselin. She got taken down. That's pass. Shatan shoots and scores. Weeks did everything he could, but the Rangers very careless around the net. Oselin lost control, and Shatan got free and scores. Two on two, as you see there. Bergenheim is a sneaky player, and, Ro and Roosevelt tried to move the puck. Roosevelt is the number one player in the league with plus minus at plus 37. Now it's now 36. He loses one here. A couple of turnovers, and Shatan just a, a quick turnaround play. Now Weeks is going to be down here, and Reaches got a piece of the puck, but it just made it over top of the goal line by about six inches. Now Weeks has to reach back. Roosevelt's down. The puck went underneath him and underneath the right. And Good Campoli. play by Campoli. Here's Nielsen back. Dropped it off. Blake. His shot blocked. Rebound. Score. Campoli followed in. The first shot was blocked. It came right to Chris Campoli. Six minutes into the second period. Islanders lead 2-0. Uh, who made the defensive play? Campoli right there. Chipped the puck away from Sakura and then saw that if he jumped into the rush, it would be a four-on-three. And sure enough, he went to the net. Yashin was picked up. Campoli wasn't, and he was able to score as he finds the puck over to his side of the ice. And before Weeks could move, he was able to score. Campoli's on the right side. This shot is blocked, and it ricochets, and there's Campoli. He just moved in as a defenseman looking for a play, and sure enough, got it. The Islanders after the defensively. Around the boards for Shatan with... Under a minute to go on the Islander power play. Martinek moving. Here's Chatan. The most dangerous man on the ice. His shot, he scores! Nero Chatan. That's what he does. He finds an opening and a great wrist shot. The Islanders have a 3-0 lead. 33rd goal of the season for a very accomplished player. Miroslav Chatan. He knows where to put the puck. And now he's going to take the puck and look around, read his options. It's kind of like a Yarmir Yager goal, Sam. That's what Yager likes to do. Cut to the middle with the options available. Shoot it, pass it. Is there a screen? He's not pressured. And there's the shot inside the post. He used to play for the Edmonton Oilers. He used to play for the Buffalo Sabres. And right now he's had a strong season for the New York really Islanders. For him, seven seconds. Yager, one last chance stopped by Erskine. That's it. Islanders beat the Rangers 3-2. Well, for the Rangers, in their point of view, they played well for one period, but they were down 3-0 when they decided to play well. For Di Pietro, he played well. He talked about this game, and he certainly upheld his bargain. Kevin Weeks played well in my mind, but the Rangers did not have a team game at all for the first two periods of play. Rangers had 24 shots on goal in the third period but and scored two goals but came up short. And the Oppenheimer Funds Team Contributor Award goes to Miro Shatan with two goals in the game. Oppenheimer Funds the right way to invest. So the Rangers stay at 100 points. The Devils with a winner at 95. Philadelphia's leading Pittsburgh 4-3.